So hello and welcome back to my channel. Uh, my name is Maria. If you are new to this channel, welcome. If you are a returning sub subscriber, welcome back. Thank you for coming back. And uh, by the way, I'm on Instagram. My name is Poviska. Uh, I'm also going to write it here on the screen so you can follow me on Instagram. Yes. So today I'm going to talk about how to be successful in online dating and secure a debt. Yeah. So these are tips that uh, I have used myself and they have been successful. So I'm giving you good tips that are going to help you secure debt. So I'm going to talk about uh, yeah because we know dating is very important especially if you want to get married you may choose to go online and look for a partner or you can uh, find a partner wherever you want maybe at your, at your workplace and maybe on the way when you're going home from uh, from school if you're studying mm -hmm. but when you're old enough old enough 18 and above yeah so uh, so yes so I'm going to talk about uh, so the first one is uh, talk about what you see on their profile so when you're doing online dating uh, it's good to talk about what you see on the profile of the people you're dating uh, like their photo, you can talk about their photo. Maybe uh, you can talk about uh, mm, the color of the of what they're wearing, their clothing, mm. and that is like that is you you can. Uh, it's usually it gives you information like that is their favorite color. Well, let's say blue. Somebody's wearing a blue shirt. You can say that. Oh, your shirt. Oh, you have a beautiful shirt. Like on your first photo, you're wearing a beautiful shirt. Your shirt is nice. This is this is something good. This one this one also gives you something to talk about. Also, you can also talk about the information that you see on their profile. Uh, if they write something like uh, mm, like you can say cycling, maybe you can talk about cycling. Or if um, they've written something like um, mm, any information that you can see on their profile, yes, you can talk about this uh, with them when you're conversing, when you're talking, and it's going to help you get to know this person and hence secure secure a debt. Another point is ask them about the day and ask them about their day. You can use words like how are you this beautiful morning or how are you this beautiful evening yes you can use this word and this helps to uh, like start a conversation or continue a conversation or it shows that you care and uh, also gives um, yeah it shows that you care how are you this beautiful evening yeah like that is like people say how are you how are you people just say how are you but when you go an extra mile and you say how are you this beautiful evening how this beautiful morning it gives it grabs attention it grabs someone's attention and they say oh mm -hmm, who is this and they will be there like okay mm -hmm. and they'll be there answering your question yeah and also another point is be yourself yeah don't imitate someone else. If you like to be funny, say something funny. Yes, if you like to be funny, say something funny. And you might find someone who also is funny like you. And uh, you two will connect. And you will establish something that will going to lead to a date. Yes. Uh, another point is, the fourth point is, don't give other persons, uh, don't give other persons photo. Uh, use your own photo because when this person will see you on a date he or she will know that it's you and you will not have 
and you will not have guarantee for second date. So use your own photos. When you're when you're on online dating and you want to secure a date, don't do not lie and use a, fo a photo of someone else. Hmm? Uh, use your own photo. Yes. Uh, because if you go on a date with this person and then they see, oh, uh, this is the person, this is the person that is on the photo and the person that is uh, in front of me is different. Do you think you're going to get a, a second date? No. And the conversation could, would have stopped there, it's going to stop there. You will not get a second date. So if, and, and, you are, and your dating is, is, will not be successful. So be truthful. Use your own photo. Another point is know what you want. If you are looking for marriage, then go for those wanting marriage. If you're looking for if mm, you can state this in your profile uh, that you want something serious that can lead to marriage and uh, and if you are looking for fun, leave. Uh, if you are looking for fun, if you are there looking for fun, and you don't want marriage, then leave leave those people alone. Those, those ones that are looking for marriage, don't go talking to them and confusing them while you are you are you you are just looking for fun. If you are looking for fun, look, look for those people who are looking for fun. If you are looking for marriage, go for those people that are looking for marriage. In that way, you are understanding each other, hmm? and as you are going to secure debt, that is going to to be according to what you want. Yeah. Another point is, uh, picture shows a lot. If you are posting profile picture showing lots of skin, e.g., cleavage, or in a bikini, you will be uh, you will be attracting wrong people, who will be looking for something else uh, that you do not want. Uh, post pictures that show less. So don't don't post pictures that are showing. Uh, for example, for example, you are you are you have posted a bikini picture and you want somebody who wants marriage. Like if somebody sees you sees you in a bikini, like uh, they'll think that maybe you want fun. You're not there for something serious. So post pictures that are uh, post pictures of you wearing something that is elegant. Yes. A what I'm wearing is not something bad. What I'm wearing right now, if you take a picture and you post something like this, there's something good. It's going to secure you a very good date. And you're going to you're going to, to deter those people that are there for who don't want marriage. If they see you they'll just be passing and they will not be they will not come there to <clears throat> like to, to disturb you with their words that are not good to you. So post pictures that are showing less, less skin, okay? <laughs> Another point is read books. Read books. There are books that talk about online dating. Look for them, read and learn them. And re uh, read and learn and practice them. And you can Google books that are talking about online dating. You can Google them on Google and then you go maybe on Amazon and buy them or maybe in bookshop or in bookstores and buy them and read and get information about online dating. Also watch YouTube videos like this one, the one that I'm talking about right now. Yes, uh, that, has, that are showing you and giving you points on what to do when you are uh, when you're doing online dating or when you're looking for a partner or you want to secure a debt yes so this is a uh, this is what I had for for you today uh, also something else if you are going on a uh, online dating yes if you're going on online dating know that uh, people know that you are looking for for a partner and those people that are there that are there they are looking for a partner and just as you will be talking to not one person and they will also be talking to some other people don't be strict on them yes and what wanting to like uh, monitor them what are they doing uh, who 
are they with something like that know that they will be talking to you because again you are here to to get to know people yes so be let it be it on the back of your mind that also these people are talking to other people yes and they are getting to they are getting to know one another yes so that's what i had for you today and uh, thank you for watching uh, share your points share other points on the comment section on uh, any information that you know about online dating i'll be it will be my pleasure to read your comments and uh, hear what you have to say like this video share it with your friends and uh, until next time bye